In this video, I have some awesome Android apps that you shouldn't miss out for 2025. Starting off with the number one app, and that's a widget app that you've been asking about a lot. So name of this app is Pixel Clock Widget. Available for free on Google Play Store. There are a lot of nice looking free themes here that you can check out. Most of the clock themes here are inspired by Pixel's material design, giving them a clean and minimal look. Link for this app will be down in description. Next app on this list is Pixel Bookmark. So what this app really does, it saves all your links and bookmarks with images so you can easily find the link you've been looking for. And you don't have to open this app to save a link. When you're on the website that you want to save, just tap on Share and choose Pixel Bookmark. So that's how easy it is. By getting premium, you can get a bit more options, but I think the free version is all you need to save and check out your bookmarks later on. Local Send is an app that you shouldn't miss out this year. This file sharing app is a lot better than Snapdrop, ShareDrop, or any other web-based file sharing service. You can send files from your Android to your Mac and iPhone. All you need is to be on the same Wi-Fi network and install this app both on your Android and iPhone. Which file sharing service you are using right now? Let me know in the comment section. Nothing KWGT is an awesome app that has some amazing widgets from simple and minimal to informative ones that will make your phone look fresh and new. This is a paid app, but I think it's worth checking out. TimeWise is an app that lets you set a countdown towards a specific date. The cool thing about this app are the live widgets. Some premium features are also available with this app, but I think the free one just does the job pretty well. Circle to search is something that Google and Samsung advertise a lot in 2024. But if your phone is still missing out on circle to search, simply install this amazing app called circle to search available on Play Store. After giving all necessary permissions, this app works exactly like circle to search on Samsung phones. Text behind is a cool app that you can use to write text behind any image. And this is a lot better than all those editing apps that do the same job. With a few clicks, you can place text behind your subject. For example, I am placing 2025 behind my subject like this. You can adjust the size, you can change the font and a lot more options are available here. So give this app a try. It's a lot easier than all those editing apps out there. If you cannot wait for One UI 7 update for your Galaxy phone, then you can check out this app called One Pro Dog. This app has all One UI 7 icons, but in dog mode. Even One UI 7 Beta 2 has no dark mode icons. I think Beta 3 or Beta 4 will introduce One UI 7 dark mode for icons. But with this app, you can check out One UI 7 dark mode icons on any Android phone. This app will cost you a dollar, and I'm using it with Samsung's stock launcher with the help of ThemeStar, which is a good lock module. Check it out, this will work on any Android phone. Last app for today's episode is a game, and this is Monument Valley 3. Yes, this is a lot popular game and the cool part is that it is free to download and play. All you need is an active Netflix account and that's it. It has some amazing animations and puzzles that are worth checking out. So those are all the apps that you cannot miss out in 2025. With that said, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Until then, bye bye.